As reported by David Wong on November 5, 2024, the HQ-19 surface-to-air missile system, also known as Hongqi-19, is set to make its public debut at the 2024 Zhuhai Air Show. This advanced Chinese anti-ballistic missile, ABM interceptor, is engineered to engage ballistic missile threats both within and beyond the atmosphere, akin to the United States' THAAD-ER system. Despite being showcased for the first time, the HQ-19 is already operational within the People's Liberation Army Air Force, PLAF, and has appeared in previous reports. The HQ-19 is mounted on an 8x8 high-mobility truck, featuring a six-missile launcher configuration. It employs a cold launch mechanism at a steep angle, enhancing its ability to intercept incoming ballistic missiles. The system's radar technology, including the 610A information radar, boasts detection capabilities for targets at ranges of approximately 4,000 kilometers. This coverage extends from northern South Asia to China's inland regions, such as the Tibetan Plateau. The HQ-19's integrated command and control system utilizes radar data to improve target tracking and interception accuracy. The HQ-19's development began in the late 1990s as part of China's 863 program, which aimed to enhance the nation's high-tech defense capabilities. Its guidance system incorporates an infrared seeker with side windows, designed to minimize atmospheric interference and ensure precise targeting at high altitudes. The missile is powered by a two-stage solid rocket engine that features carbon fiber construction and the N-15B solid propellant. This configuration achieves a specific impulse of 260 seconds, enabling high maneuverability for intercepting moving warheads. The missile's double-pulse engine design enhances terminal kinetic effectiveness and extends operational range. With innovations in composite materials, the HQ-19 can maneuver at forces of up to 60 g during interception, demonstrating remarkable agility. The HQ-19 boasts an intercept range of up to 3,000 kilometers, allowing it to engage ballistic missiles, including their re-entry warheads. Notably, its kinetic kill warhead places it among a select few global systems equipped with this technology, comparable to the U.S. Kinetic Kill Vehicles, KKV. China has demonstrated early capability in kinetic kill technology, successfully completing a test flight as early as 1999, making it the second nation to develop this capability after the U.S. Multiple tests have validated the HQ-19's functionality, including successful interceptions at altitudes exceeding 200 kilometers and relative speeds up to 10 meters per second. In February 2021, China's Ministry of National Defense confirmed a trial where the HQ-19 met all operational expectations. The tests, conducted between 2010 and 2021, have emphasized the system's defensive nature, with officials stating it is not aimed at any specific country. The HQ-19's unveiling at the airshow could signal its availability for potential export, particularly to markets in the Middle East. China's defense industry has expressed interest in broadening its client base beyond traditional partners like Pakistan, Saudi Arabia, and Egypt, seeking to tap into emerging markets. The HQ-19's capabilities may appeal to countries in need of robust missile interception systems, aligning with China's broader strategy to expand its military export sector and foster bilateral ties through defense cooperation. In addition to the HQ-19, China's ballistic missile defense framework includes complementary systems like the HQ-9 and HQ-26. The HQ-26, equipped with a multiple solid motor, enhances terminal kinetic performance, extending its range and allowing it to target a wider array of missile threats. The phased array radar of the HQ-19 is designed to integrate with these systems, providing early warning capabilities and supporting a multi-layered missile defense strategy. Overall, the HQ-19 exemplifies China's ongoing efforts to bolster its missile defense capabilities. Comparisons with the US THAAD and SM-3 systems highlight its potential impact on regional security dynamics. Observers suggest that the HQ-19 may serve as a countermeasure against ballistic missiles in the South Asian region, particularly against India's Agni-4 and Agni-5 systems. By showcasing the HQ-19 at the Zhuhai Airshow, China emphasizes its strategic commitment to enhancing missile defense in response to evolving global power structures and regional security challenges.